Hello guys, today we are gonna fix this uh, preamp guitar amplifier from EMT Electronics, it's, it's uh, SS20 it is a preamp with a one tube 12VX7 and this is the easiest fix that I ever done <laughs> one day my friend bring me this amplifier, he said it is dead and also he bring me the adapter and he said uh, he lost the adapter and he buy a new adapter like this it's a uh, 12 volt and he said the, the the guitar amplifier is dead totally dead and I already checking all I already open and I already inspect all the components check the capacitors, the ICs and it seems everything is okay and until I notice one thing I read the manual PDF from the AMT Electronics SS20 as you can see this uh, this is 12 volt DC and you can see the sign there plus is the outside and minus is the inside so for the regular adapter usually the jack the outside is a negative and inside is positive so this preamp needs a reverse polarity adapter so I'm trying with another adapter it is uh, I have this uh, boss adapter and you can see the logo there you can see the, the symbol there the inside is minus and the outside is positive so this is the kind of adapter you need to turn on this MT preamp uh, effects I'm trying with this uh, boss by the way it has uh, output uh, 9 volt and 1 amp or 1000 milliamp it is actually working it will turn on okay so that's it I fixed the dead amplifier the dead preamplifier and Please remember when you buying an adapter for a guitar effects like this please read the manual for the the polarity for the adapter this one is correct and this is the regular adapter it's not functioning for this type of guitar effects also I notice this preamp effects needs 1.25 ampere 12 volt DC and I'm notice none of this uh, adapter has the correct size for example this one is 1000 milliamp it is supposed to be 1250 milliamp or 1.25 amp also the voltage is wrong it is 9 volt not 12 volt even though you can turn on the device with this adapter my suggestion is using the same or similar milliamp and voltage because it will affect your sound quality for example you will have a buzzing noise if you using only 500 milliamp or 300 milliamp it will causing the sound noise from your effects or it will damage your device in the long term okay that's it guys that's it for today uh, thank you for watching this video please subscribe and like and share if you like this video and see you in my next video feel free to comment below and thank you terima kasih